Hello and welcome. You've made it to the other side. This is Lawrence Gold, your guide for Intelligent Self-Empowerment 101, Getting Unstuck in Life. In this course, I'll be teaching you a gold key release, a method of getting ourselves unstuck even from unconscious and entrenched habits of mind and life that keep us stuck. I'm going in this clip to give you an overview of the course and get you started on the basic procedure that we use throughout Tetra Seed procedures from time to time to drill through and release deeply entrenched, crusty, habituated, stuck patterns of mind and life. As a seven week course, we meet twice a week for approximately 45 minutes per meeting. And the first meeting is an instruction and practice meeting with room for question and answer. The second meeting each week will be more informal and it will be for you to share what you undertook in the earlier meeting and how you may have used the procedure in the ensuing days, what happened, and the results that followed in the ensuing days. And in each meeting, we will have the opportunity to come into the live face-to-face -face section of the Google Hangouts, which puts you on camera, on microphone, and in direct connection and communication with me. Up to nine people can go into that section so up to nine will be participating live and directly as we go through the teaching processes with me monitoring your progress. And during the procedures, I'll be asking you to signal in some way, generally a nonverbal hand gesture or maybe opening the eyes if you've closed them. So I know that you're ready for the next step. And if during certain steps of the procedures, particularly what I call the setup, which I'll describe momentarily. When you feel like you've gotten the result, you may remove yourself from the live on camera section so that someone else may come in. So let's go into the preparatory or orientation materials first. There are two. One, as I mentioned, is called the setup. And the purpose of the setup is to awaken and enliven your awareness of the four basic faculties of your existence, which are attention, intention, memory, and imagination. Now, everybody uses those four faculties naturally and automatically. They also use them semi-consciously and habitually. And it's that habitual semi-consciousness that causes the perpetuation of habitual patterns of mind and life. And the setup, by making those four faculties conscious, bring them into reach of your conscious control, enabling you to shift those habitual patterns. So that's fundamental to the use of all of the Tetra Seed procedures. And I will be taking you and the group through the procedure to awaken those faculties in the beginning meetings of the course. When I see that everybody's got a good handle, we'll discontinue that, but you may use the setup in your private practicing at any time to prepare yourself. So that's the setup. And the second thing that we'll be covering in this video and tutorial is a process I call the tongue mudra. Now, mudra is a Sanskrit term which translates as seal, S-E-A-L. And what you're sealing in, in effect, or containing or gathering is your attention and your intention. The tongue mudra makes it possible to shift deeply entrenched, crusty, stuck, habitual states of mind and action so that you can, in that very moment, shift yourself out of them in such a way that you can feel the shift, not just emotionally, but generally 
as a spontaneous postural shift, a straightening and a freeing up. And shortly, I'll be giving you your first exposure to the tongue mudra in an instructional clip. And in that clip, you'll notice in the upper right corner, either a little eye in a circle, which means information available, or a little banner, which contains a clickable link to the tongue mudra, so that by going there and bookmarking that page, you can go to that instruction at any time without having to listen to this entire introductory clip here. So now the clip on the tongue mudra. Listen and practice what you hear instructed there. I'm going to talk you through using the tongue mudra or tongue pose. Here's the positioning. The tip of your tongue on the roof of your mouth behind your front teeth. The back of your tongue lifted and secured against your rear upper molars. The center of your tongue cupped like a spoon or radar dish facing upward. So you get the contact at the tip of your tongue and the back of your tongue right and left upper molars. Your tongue is cupped and aimed toward the roof of your mouth. And now you sense the center of the roof of your mouth above the tongue cup or radar dish. You feel it light up, become sensitized, feel it turn on the center of the roof of your mouth. Feeling that Breathe through your nose and feel the current of connection between the feeling of the air going in your nose and the roof of your mouth being turned on. And just feel that for a while until you can get it. Just alternate feeling your palate and the inside of your nose until you can balance them and get them both turned on together. Do that for a while and then turn the recording on again when you're ready. Okay, so you turned on the roof of your mouth, your palate, and you breathed in through your nasal cavity and you felt the current go, a current of ascending sensation. Some might call it energy going up from the roof of the mouth through the nasal cavity and suddenly you can feel the center of your nose, your septum, and you can feel how that connects in the back to the upper back of your nasal cavity. So do that now and turn it on again when you're ready. Now you're ready, good. You may have noticed that when you've got it going up through your nasal septum that it went to the floor of your brain cavity and it might have gone to the roof of your brain cavity and through that a line going through your brain core in a certain location that you feel internally. Do you have a question? We want to see to it that you gets that it gets answered for you so that you have the level of proficiency in the gold key release that I want everybody to have. Mastery of the gold key release is a prerequisite for attendance in later courses in the Intelligent Self-Empowerment series. So with that, I bid you welcome and the course starts this coming Monday, August the 3rd, at 11 a.m. Mountain Time, 
your time zone, of course, adjusting the time accordingly. We'll see each other there.